In the original ending of Universal's 1935 classic, The Bride of Frankenstein, Baron Henry Frankenstein, played by Colin Clive, dies in the tower explosion along with his monster, the bride, and the evil Dr. Pretorius. This suited Clive just fine as he really wanted Baron Frankenstein to die in a glorious fashion. Strangely, wimpy test audiences objected strongly and wanted Henry Frankenstein to live on with his bride, Elizabeth. The ending was reshot, but in the film, shots of the lab exploding still clearly show Henry Frankenstein himself cowering up against the wall. I guess if Frankenstein had not lived, he could not have had the sons that continued the series well into the late 1940s. It's very true. Someone was thinking ahead.